Hi friends, I am starting an experiment to grow cilantro in a hope garden. I have recently grown cilantro in I do 8 pod hydroponic system. I do 8 pod and this a hope garden looks very similar and they both have same specs. Let's see how cilantro will work out in this garden. I am using some off brand sponges. All right, I have all my pots ready. Now I'm going to place seeds. Cilantro seeds have a very hard shell on them and there are actually two gems in each seed. So breaking the seed will help fasten the germination. Gently press and roll the seed that will split it. All right, now I have two seeds. I'm just splitting few more seeds. See, it's very easy. All right, now I have a few seeds ready. Now I'm placing about three seeds in each pod. We can easily manage up to three plants per pod. So even if all seeds germinated, I'm going to go with that. Thinning the seedlings is not necessary for cilantro. This is the last pod. That's it. The garden is ready. As always, I will add water, but I will not add nutrition right away. I will start adding nutrition once I see the seedlings. All right, the garden is all set and good to go. It's been seven days. I see one seed germinated in one pod. I don't see any signs of germination from other pods. It's day 8. I see two more seedlings coming from another pod. This is really exciting. Now that I see few seedlings, I will start adding nutrition. I already prepared a nutrient solution with Maxi Grow Dry Nutrients. Now I am going to pour it. Since this is just the beginning, I dissolved only one teaspoon of nutrients. It's day 13. I see seedlings in two more pods. This is really nice and I see seeds sprouted in one more pod so with this now I have seedlings in five pods this is really amazing growing cilantro is getting easy day by day it's day 22 the seedlings are coming very nice and they started developing huge leaves this is all going very well I don't see any signs of germination from these three pods so I gave up and just replaced the seeds with new ones it's day 30, the cilantro is coming excellent. I see the new seeds sprouted in two pods. I don't see any signs of germination in the third pod. Now I am going to give up on this pod. I am not even going to try replacing the seeds at this time. It's day 35, the cilantro is coming excellent. I kept on harvesting. The new plants also coming nice. So this is all going well. I see a few tip burns but that's pretty common with cilantro. The fresh growth is coming nice, not to worry much. It's day 60, the cilantro is coming excellent. The cilantro is about 7 to 8 inches tall and there is a lot of cilantro coming. I have been harvesting this cilantro every other day and it is coming back really fast and nice. The new seedlings that came from the replaced seeds didn't survive. They survived but they are struggling a lot. The existing cilantro is taking over the garden and always blocking the light. So the new seedlings were struggling so much so I took them out. Right now I have plants in 5 pots but the 5 pots itself took over the entire garden and it is coming excellent. I am getting lots of cilantro. So this experiment is going excellent. This again proved that growing cilantro is easy peasy. It worked out very well in Ido and now it worked very well in a hope garden. So I'm going to keep on experimenting this even in aero gardens and see if I can find easy peasy ways to grow cilantro. Alright that is all for now. Thanks for watching and happy gardening.